Ah, you're approaching me. I like his coat. I want his coat. It's red, kind of. What a world this was. This is what people did all day. Stop carving the wood and get do something. People will tell that. Whitt whittling. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. What? We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? For what? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pierce. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough nothing. of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something neat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Yes. Come along. Here, you take this. I can't use it and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. Hmm. All right, let's head out. All right. <laughs> uh. Hunting time. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. Hmm. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. We're going downhill though. Whew. Yeah. Been a wild few days, alright. This is Skyrim. That ride north from Blackwater? Getting stuck in the Who's storm, Charles? Going out from John, this guy in front of me? You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. <laughs> well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. I don't want to... What a game. Hello, usual haze. Oh, 
What about fishing? Where's the fishing rod from Fortnite? Fishing rod. Random ass cutscene. I think this is for loading times. Look at the water though. Look at the water. I think it's useless to screenshot in this game. It's just everything's pretty beautiful. Worthless. Come on. Let's try this way. Keep your eyes peeled for movement. A lot of snow in these beginning missions. The Red Dead 1 had to be started off on a the ranch. Died down too. I think. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No shh. Stay quiet. You're alright, boy. Stop petting your horse. Stop here a second. I see something. There's deer been here recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Let's walk it from here. You're gonna need the bow. Don't leave it on your horse. A gun will scare everything around. Would it? No, use the bow I gave you. That'll make too much noise. Well, there's no point setting off without that bow. Are you sure? Yes, Bo. I'm learning. The Bo Arthur. The sh sh shotgun? Into the direction of deer. See the tracks? I uh, think so. Maybe not. Focus. Stop hitting them. Stop letting them. I played a game like this before. What if it just like, like left with a bunch of poop behind? Just poop. There's no footprints. Just a bunch of poop. Wait, look. I can't hit it from there here. They are. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. Can I try to hit him in the neck or head? Quick and clean. You can pull back quite hard. I don't know what the angle is. Shut up, man. I don't know how to. Is, there's no. Is there bullet time? I mean, drop. I, I think where you aim it is where it actually is. How are they going to expect you to hit that? Like, I don't know how the game works yet. So I think where, where the dot is is where it's going to be. Let's just assume that first. Messed up. He's gonna run away for miles now. It's over. 
It's over now. I think it's over again. I blew it. Now let's try for another. Hey, what? Who's going to haul this back? We'll scare them all off. Who's gonna bring all this back home? Great soundtrack. Doom, doom, doom. He's bleeding. Are you dead yet? I can't hit you. There you go, well works. Done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay, I'll go grab the other one. Whistle. I'll come with you. I'm energetic. Stow the deer. <laughs> What's going on with me? Uh, okay. 
Yeah. It's so bright. It's too damn bright. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Watch it! Oh, watch, watch it. it. Nice work, Arthur. Ah! Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off this mountain now. Soon. People are still weak, and well, you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what then? We still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Dutch and Jose will have a plan. Notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. What the hell is this horse? Is that his horse? horse. She lost her husband died at home. Everything she had. So what do we do with her? Oh, oh yeah, I, I killed him. I killed that horse. Back on our feet. We'll see. In this universe. Family somewhere. Who knows? Oops. Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> Well, I know who my money's on in that fight. I remember, the, yeah, the horses He's stay there if you kill them. Damn. That makes him much more useful. Maybe uh, we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Yeah. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well... We've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back. Dutch. He's definitely way. from the first game. A proper blood Dutch. feud. So I heard. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Must be real hungry. Stay well back. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. True. So what do we do? You and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just... I know you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. 
I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. 20 years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things. Him and Jose. He's like the son of John. I'm sure. In Dutch. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Pretty windy. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses Mr. as on Grin. the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. Count Dooku? Hmm. Every time one one of these days we're gonna come back and the whole town's gonna be burning. We're gonna get attacked. Or we're gone. I'm gonna hitch time over here. This guy sounds like he's voiced he voiced someone in the back, Metal Gear. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. I already mastered it. It's already mastered. Well, well, well. <clears throat> you still alive? Just drop it down in here. You dick. On the floor? Okay. What oh. a surprise find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken no for days. I do my me. utmost to avoid you. Ah, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. Showing oh, affection. Let me now tell you about him. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Best game. Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one that you dumped on the floor there. You told me to, man. Oh, God. Oh, man, that's what it looks like. Uh, without the skin. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <clears throat> a few days 
late, a tough few days later. Oh, oh. It's been a bad few weeks. What was that say? What did that say? Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Leviticus. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but. Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. The boy. You see me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? The boy. Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now. Railway man. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? He said it. He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Downing. Everyone ready? All right, let's head out. Hey, skin hunter. I see what they're doing. It's like a cutscene thing. Uh... What train that? Is what I call a crew. Micah Bell. 
Carl Smith, Arthur Morgan, Javier Escuela, and what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm and keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No Whoa. mistakes. Screenshot Andy. So we do this. Then we go back. I can't take a one. it's hard to take a screenshot while we're doing this. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back. And that's the end of it. The money's safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. Or we could just all have a picnic right okay. here. There's the water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Boo. Boo. Let me take a look. I want to look at Bill. Where's my binoculars? What? When I actually want to use a binocular, there it is. Oh. Are you waiting? Shut up, man. Four. I want to look at Bill. Where'd he go? This is a good spot. Yeah, I must remember to thank Tom O'Driscoll for planning it out so well for us. And for providing all the explosives. <laughs> Real generous of the feller. Well, go on then. I don't know where he is, but okay. He vanished. Oh my. Now this feels like Red Dead. Yep. Shows him on the map. I don't know where the hell he was. How you getting on? Yeah, I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. so long I think someone's being attacked by a bear or something okay this is good all right that should do it you head back up to the others I got it from here Probably dead by now. 
Don't need you distracting me here, Morgan. Give me your money. What if I shoot it? What if I shoot the bomb? What if I shot the bomb? Nah, 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 nah. Train's gonna be here any minute. Remember the plan, all of you, no mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Payday two? The beginning of the typo negative song. Gentlemen, it's time. Burnt flowers. Good luck. All of you. You all know what to do. Yo, boy, what kind of handkerchief is that? Hold on, let's talk about that. You're gonna still do it? You messed it up. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. you to die whoever you are all right you're not the guy i wanted to live but all right i guess Take that. Oh, shit. It's like a lightsaber. Nothing, no choice. Shut up, man, you're rushing me. Can we move up? Why don't you move up? I'll follow you. Let me check his body real quick. I got a feeling about this guy. 73 cents. Pocket watch. Come on, let's get to the front. What is wrong with you Oh yeah. I know, just stay calm. I didn't know that. We have to stop this train. Oh my god. The conductor's getting in on this. Oodle, oodle. Back up. I got a clear shot. Are you Abraham Lincoln? Yeah. That's the man. Oh my god. I forget the gun. There's no time. Stop the train. Hogwarts. Oh, he's running now. Shit, more guards coming out of that train car. Ah, there better be some money at the end of this. 
headshot. Why is the red coat? Oh, there you go. You can do it. What happened? Lenny died. What? That's not my fault. Lenny was going in. It's like a Fortnite game where like, your friend goes charging in like a mile away. Bro. Bro. Hmm, I don't know. Controller's just way more comfortable. Why am I responsible for Lenny as well? Why is... Uh... Lenny! If he dies, he should just die. Revolver, but whatever. You two all right? Yes, let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. So, we don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. What's up, Bardock? Thanks for the host. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. What's up, Raiders? We're, just, we're raiding this train cart. Perfect timing. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Now light the fuse. Here we go. It was like a cartoon show. Wish. I'd step back, fellas. Dive. I do a cool dive. All right, come on. I wanted to. I wanted to do a cool dive. We don't want to kill you. We just want to rob your boss. Get on up there. Search that train. Ha, 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 ha. 
Me first. Me first. Come on, guys. Come on. Bardock Live, then you know. Look at this place. It's like a palace. Well, now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. I'm gonna light a cigar right now. I wish you could smoke a cigar like for like a, a, like five train. minutes straight. Oh, I can't smoke it right now. I'll give you that. I have my mask on. Okay. See if we can get this open. Stale. I like it. I'm having more fun than Jedi, but I like both games. There. I played Star Wars the other day. Switch between both games. There. See? That's how it's done. Lock box. It, I understand why you wouldn't like it. But I get it. It's a little clunky. A little weird. Useful. At least we all know like you move like it's kind of stiff know. sometimes I got, him. I got some documents come on I got some documentation <laughs> I got some patch notes what's that ticking noise the card uh, my favorite one let's hurry this along now it's always me the last gay dear just waiting on you Arthur can I take this oil delivery Yes, poo poo head. I take it. <laughs> take some brandy. What did you find? <laughs> nothing, Eesh. nothing. Oh, bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bear bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Bear bonds. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah. Uh, Get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're not into it. Yeah. Okay, get on the train, quick. No. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. Get a move on. If I hear so much as a footstep from this car, you'll end up like all your friends out here. No time to search the drawers. If I see anything worth taking. Oh, dead bodies still. There's no time to loot them. I'm getting too old for this shit. What's he doing? Wait, what? Uh... I said, are they going to live? They'll be all right. Those, those guys will be fine. I'll let them go, technically. Oh, for Lord's sake. Put that book away and go help. Oh, Mary Beth. 
So, we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well, then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Mm. Oh, yeah. What a masterpiece. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. You could buy me a whiskey. So you're finally awake, huh? I ruined it. The song's gone now. Yeah. Built Ford to. Uh oh. Damn it, we're stuck. <laughs> Can you do something? Maybe. What's the problem Easy. now? Uh oh. Just like old times. One more time, one more time. Jeez. <laughs> Man, I remember in Red Dead 1, you could just keep whipping the horses while riding them. Just keep whipping them. Wait a minute. Let me try one more thing. Yes. Hurry it up. We've got work to do. Yep. Hey, watch out for the rock. Yep. There we go. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> I broke their legs or something. What happened? I, I want to try that again, going backwards, full speed backwards, though. Now, this is what I'm talking about.
<laughs> now this is Red Dead Redemption, I'm gonna tell you about it. Let's get going. I wanna be there before nightfall. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, oh all the weight. Oh my god. Classic. Right, one more thing I wanna try. One more thing I wanna try. I oh, can't shoot your gun. Get us out the stream. Gotta keep us moving, but calm. Not too rough, there, brother. Mission fail. Let's take a look. That's part of the game. Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. I'll be able to bust it. All right, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wagon? Shut up. I'm just saying. Well, say less. Let's see you. Pick the wheel up. Bash it in. Nearly there. Ooh. Ooh. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Uh oh. Think. If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Did they wave back? Did they wave back though? Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. So, yes, the Indians in these parts got sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stole them clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or Herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't, in spite of that just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles. Bridges, Bridges of Madison County? Just because it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, you know, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did. When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man, and the drink had a mean hold on him. Around 13. I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. I like Maybe this guy older, next to me. A wilder delinquent. He's probably gonna die. See. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Yeah, it's a long story. 
Another we time. The right way. That depends. Where did the other guys Are go? Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls, our kind of place. The Driscolls? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him, but we kept telling him that fairy job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. People die. Is that God's the thumb? Is, always has been. Me, you, Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And we're still here, so... I figure we must have got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some oh, yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. That's not how I thought it was. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah. You can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. What? Herbs. Yep. Thanks, old feller. <laughs> what a what a what a what a story. Uh geez.